Hello everybody, my name is Charlie Cherawi and I'm the CEO and founder at Weiru and today I'm going to show you how to mint your OG Genesis device on the Solana blockchain. Out of the box, this is how it comes. There's the unit, there's a small manual. You can put it here. You have an Ethernet cable. You have your power cable right here. And you have your power over the Ethernet adapter. So what we have to do is you have to get one Ethernet cable, one comes in the box and you have to get another one because you can get one as long or as short as you want. We don't know how far from your internet box you're gonna set up your unit. So that's why it doesn't come with the, with the unit so you can figure that out yourself. So this has to go in the one port. So you connect it on the one port. You can just put this here back just for some extra security. And then the cable is going to go into the power over the ethernet port on your power over the ethernet adapter. Why? Because this will power up your unit and will also provide it with connectivity. Now, we're gonna put this aside and you have your other cable that you have to get, you connect this cable to your internet router and then you connect it to the POE adapter on the LAN port so that you can bring the connectivity to the adapter and thus to the unit. And then you finally connect the unit to the power. This is how the unit has to be connected so that you can set it up. Now, once it's set up, we can go to our mobile app. Once we are on our mobile app, we go to miners. When we are here in Miners, we can add a new miner. Uh, this is a uh, Genesis. And we're gonna choose Solana. Once we choose Solana, it tells us a little instructions about what we need before setup. And it's gonna take us through the process of what I just showed you. Where do you have to connect each cable on your unit? Now it's checking for permission locations. Now it's gonna try to connect to the, we're gonna try to do it directly ourselves. So it prompted us uh, to connect to the Wear Genesis. So we went to the phone's Wi-Fi settings and we are now connected to the Wire Genesis network. So we can come back and proceed. Now it's getting the device data from, uh, from the device. It says it's ready. It's connected to the internet and now it's uh, ready to register the device. Registering the device, approval received, firmware upgrade started. The firmware upgrade has started. You will receive a notification when the device is ready. Uh, note that this should not take longer than 15 minutes. Okay, so just click continue and you have to wait for 15 minutes until our router is fully updated. Okay, now we're gonna go to notifications. Uh, effectively, your device has a pending configuration. So we click on that notification, it takes me back to the process. It asks me to locate the device uh, on the map. So I'm gonna adjust the location right here. We're done, adjust location, connect to the Wayro operator network. So now it prompts me to connect to the network just to make sure that the device is located where you are saying that it's going to be located. We join the network, it's connecting to the network. We are connected to the wearable operator, device uh, information ready, add device. So we're adding the device to our account and now new hotspot added, uh, mint the NF node to receive your rewards. Now we go to the minting process. Uh, we of course choose our Solana wallet and it's gonna prompt you to, to click on confirm to mint your device and that's it now we just have to wait for the transaction to go through and your device will be successfully added to your account now that the lg genesis has been minted you can uh, go to it you can see that it's minted on the solana blockchain and once it starts um emitting the heartbeats you get uh, you'll get it uh, at, in an online mode so now you have to remember that you can mint your nf node uh, for your OG Genesis or for anywhere of hotspot on the Solana blockchain, on the Algorand blockchain, or the IOTEX blockchain. You can choose, you just, you just have to make sure to have the right funds in your wallet. On the Solana blockchain, you're paying using Sol. On the IOTEX uh, chain, you're paying using IOTEX. And on the Algorand chain, you're paying using USDC on Algorand to mint your NF node. So make sure to uh, use the correct wallet 
uh, you can import your wallet if you want. If you change your devices, you can just import your main wallet and you can continue to, um, to mint and to manage your hotspots from your new device. Again, thank you so much for tuning in and hopefully this video was very helpful for you.